Hello and welcome back. Today we've got another £250 worth of 50p's we're hunting through looking for commemoratives. Ones with more than face value but ideally one of the three we still need to go. And the good news is we don't need a Kew Gardens because we found one fairly recently which is extraordinary. So what three do we need? They're all Olympic 50p's, goalball, rowing and triathlon. Any of those three would get us one more step closer to finishing this book and starting a brand new book. So let's get into these bags and see what we find today. Right then, bag number one. We'll open in real time and I'll show you what we're looking for. That's Britannia, the standard definitive non-commemorative design used on 50p's up to and including 2008 and it's 2008 which is the low minted circulating year we'll be looking out for. Um, the shield design became the new definitive in, tw in 2008. Uh, the key dates to look for on these are 2009, 10, 11, 16, 18 and 2021 for the non-circulating years and then 2017 for the low minted circulating year. Otherwise we'd quite happily receive any other commemoratives or oh, an Atlantic salmon we've only found two in the past It'd be great to get my hands on some more of those but it would seem bag number one is going to give us a case of the diddlies so what we'll do now is just speed up until we do find something Holy Toledo, we found something. What? That was a rubbish start. We found public libraries, which again is a very common coin. Hardly worth the wait for for that long, but uh, let's get rid of our bad luck early and we'll find some amazing stuff towards the end, hopefully. Oh, 2017 Shield. One of the key dates to look out for. I don't always spot the key dates. That's what, that's why I'm splitting out the Britannias in my hand and these shields down on the desk, so that at the end I can just whiz through the wall and actually check for the key dates. Oh, that's 2008 Britannia. Well, at least we're spotting some key dates in amongst the, all this nothing we're finding. <laughs> oh, Victoria Cross, heroic acts. That's a common coin, but we'll take it. However, saying that's a common coin, there are these 10 designs uh, which were restruck in 2019 for a collector's set of coins uh, if you find one of these do check the date in case you've come across a restrike which shouldn't be in circulation but some of them have turned up so flip it over 2006 dated that's an original circulating version of this coin not one of the 2019 restrikes sadly oh there we go Christopher Ironside star fine so far in terms of our commemoratives I guess um, I keep all my Christopher Ironsides because we share a name and uh, that didn't seem so silly when I started doing it and now it seems very silly but now I'm too stubborn to give up but uh, no, very nice. Got scouts there? Could this be a restrike? No. Oh dearie dearie dear. Oh, 
Oh, another 2008 Britannia. There we go. Twenty seventeen Tom Kitten. All the twenty seventeen bitch expositors are very, very common coins though, although <laughs> nothing seems to be very common today. Oh, Platinum Jubilee. Now uh, this could be a really cool coin because there were two versions of it. One that went into circulation, one that didn't. We need to flip it over to find out which one this is. You've got Jodie Clark's fifth and final portrait of the Queen. This is the circulating version. There was what? Five million and seventy put out into our change. So sadly, that is not the non-circulating version. The non-circulating version that is available just in collector sets has a portrait of the Queen on horseback. Uh, we've also got Commonwealth Games there. Again, fairly common coin. Oh, there we go. Another Victoria Cross Heroic Acts. Again, original circulating version though. Oh, there we go. Memorial 50p. King Charles has turned up today. But again, another fairly common coin. Oh, there we go. Another one for the king. Coronation 50p. But like the Platinum Jubilee, though, there are two versions. One circulating, one non-circulating. You can see the king is not wearing a crown in this design. This is the version that went into circulation. The crowned portrait of the king was only available in collector sets. I haven't had final 2023 mintage figures yet, so that's going to go on the unknown row. But uh, hopefully sometime soon, possibly very soon, the 2023 mintage figures will be released. And there we go, pride. Very, very nice. There's another Christopher Ironside. Well, that warms my heart somewhat. We start this bag off with another Coronation 50p. Again, the circulating version. Oh, it's another 2008 Britannia. God, I'm eagle eyed today, aren't I? Goodness gracious. Okay, oh, yeah. Roger Bannister. Could it be a restrike? No. We should try once again. Oh, UK's entrance into the EEC, the twenty-fifth anniversary of which. Uh, this coin's a smidge over face value, not enormously so, but we'll take it given how much, uh, how little we're finding in today's hunt so far. Right then, my goodness, last bag of the hunt. This has not been exceptional at all, but 
we do have to bear in mind I've just found a Q Gardens effectively. So I think this is uh, Lady Luck just rebalancing. Just reminding me it can't all be sunshine and rainbows. Um, but uh, no, I'm sure we'll get luckier on another hunt. Right. In the description of this video, as usual, you'll find links to my coin collecting Discord server. You can come and give me commiserations for this pathetic excuse of a coin hunt. Um, you can also... Uh, uh, go to my different social media channels with the links in the description right into my PO box if you so wish again The details are in the description and there's a link to the Britannia coin company's YouTube channel company I work for as my day job, so please check them out too I'm just gonna whiz through all of these coins off to the side and see whether we've got any sorely needed key dates to make up for uh, The lack of commemoratives we found well I did quite well pulling out all of the key dates throughout the hunt, but there was one additional 2008 Britannia which goes with the other, was it three we found? Our star finds. Mm. A little bit lacking. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, not the best result I've ever had. But there we go. That's the way it happens. We've had a lot of luck recently. So that's fine. Hopefully the luck returns sometime soon. If you've had a star find this week though, let us know in the comments what you found. I'm sure you bested this hunt because this is pretty pathetic, but there we go. All it leads me to do now though is thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you next time for more coins. Bye.